In section 2.10, problem number 11, we use implicit differentiation to find dy dx, where x and y are related by the equation on the board here, uh, x minus y squared uh, is equal to x squared y cubed. Now, we're just going to go ahead and assume that uh, this implicitly defines uh, y as a function of x, and we'll differentiate both sides with respect to x. Um, so differentiating gives 2 times x minus y. And now multiplied by the derivative of the inside. So 1 minus, now of course we assume that y is a function of x, so we need to uh, use the chain rule. Or excuse me, actually we just differentiate and say dy dx. And then on the right hand side, we'll use the product rule. So Differentiating the first part of the product, we have 2x y cubed. And then we have x squared. We'll have 3y squared. And then multiply that by dy dx. And here we're actually are applying the chain rule. And let's expand this and then after we expand this, we'll put all the terms with dy dx on one side, everything else on the other side, and then factor out and solve for dy dx. So here we have x uh, minus uh, dy dx times x plus y plus, uh, excuse me, minus y. And then here the signs cancel out, so we do have positive y uh, times dy dx. And the right-hand side will remain the same for now. Plus 3x squared y squared dy dx. And I'll start over again here at the top of the board. And now let's, uh, so I'm going to distribute the 2 through the entire left-hand side. And at the same time, I'll leave everything that has dy dx on the left-hand side and move everything else to the right. So we'll have uh, left over on the left-hand side will be t uh, negative 2x dy dx. And we'll also have positive 2y dy dx. And we'll move everything else to the other side of the um, equal sign. So that'll be uh, 2x, but we'll move it over and it'll uh, pick up a minus sign. And we'll have minus 2y, but that becomes positive. And on the right hand side, we have 2 uh, plus 2xy two cubed uh, plus 3x squared y squared. And then we'll move the 3x squared y squared. Oh, excuse me, this should, is part of the term that has dy dx. So we'll move that to the left side of the equal sign. So now we can solve for uh, dy dx. We'll factor that out and then divide by what's remaining. So on the right hand side, we'll have minus 2x plus 2y plus 2xy cubed all over uh, exactly this line here without the dy dx since we factored it out. So that would be over minus 2x plus 2y minus 3x squared y squared. And here's our formula for the derivative of y with respect to x.